right without much ado, you started your local government tour uh, of Ikita State yesterday. I have to only invite Mr. Governor to the center of the call immediately. The chairs of the MTA because of the constraints of time with them and uh, their name. And then we continue uh, with the program. We have them in five categories. For our head title, the laborer, she's taking a large wheelchair. And the large flight title, we have Arehe Michael Vessel. And four for the hearing aid, we have Rizzi Bakari. And last, but by no means the least, we have Kim. All right. Before the government makes its presentation, I'm just told again that it's red. Glory. Mr. Governor, I'd like to call on give you a large wheelchair. Okay, Taiwo, Debra. Okay, Taiwo, Debra. Large wheelchair, courtesy MTN Foundation Disability Support Project. And we put our hands together, ladies and gentlemen. That's okay, Taiwo, Debra. Congratulations. 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 Let's put our hands together one more time, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much. Arebe Michael. Arebe Michael receiving a large flight cycle. Making the presentation of the governor being assisted by the Commissioner for Youth and Sports. For the MTA Foundation. Yeah, only got one, yeah. Snapshots, photographs are being taken. This way, this way, this way. Also on the entourage of the government, you can see the Chief of Staff, Secretary of the Government, and Commissioner for Information and Seeding Orientation. Let's put a hand together for Alec Michael. Thank you very much. Half of Soro. Half of the school of the blind. Where's the student? Okay, do you want to No, just one. Okay. Like we see to run a test to show the whole world that it's real. Rizzi Bakari is receiving hearing aids and thereafter is going to do a test to ensure that the equipment is working. So can you, Are you there? The Excellency, can you just put your hand on the hearing? Are you here now? Hello. Hello. Oh. The other one. The other one yeah, yeah, so. well. yeah. Then we moved on with the tour of local government. The MTN Foundation team and uh, the, the partners of MTN, particularly our elder, uh, Prince uh, Julius Adelis Adeli, and uh, this is Noni Ugonite. Uh, my brothers and sisters, I am really delighted to be here with you. I would have loved to spend the entire day here uh, with this support that the MTN Foundation has made available to us. For me, disability is not inability. Yeah. I'm glad that you're not treating it as one. Many of you did not make yourself the way you are. It's the accident of life that has made this happen. But even in moments of daunting challenges, we must always thank God, but we must always insist that we can still excel in whatever we do. And I know that you will excel in all of what you do. And that is why APT State, under this administration, has made it very, very clear that there is automatic employment for
So, we don't see why your physical situation should be an impediment to progress in what you do in life. And I'm also glad that the MTM Foundation reasons along side with us on these issues. That's what has informed what they're making available to uh, you here today. And we're glad that APT is one of the three states that have been chosen by the MTM Foundation to benefit uh, from this support. We're very grateful to the leadership of the MTM Foundation, the board, uh, and the executive secretary of the foundation for the support. And we're delighted that many of you are beneficiaries of these support from the foundation. I am delighted to be here. I look forward to continuous engagement with many of you in the course of uh, your uh, work in the state. And if there is anything that you think I should know that I'm not yet aware of, I hope you would all find it uh, necessary to communicate with my office about issues affecting the disabled. I'm also very delighted that the uh, Director of NTA Foundation mentioned the question of a bill to be sent to the House of Assembly. The right level speaker of the House, Dr. Adewale Omiri, is here with me and is listening very, very attentively to what was said. I am aware that a bill has passed through the House in the past. Uh, and I know that we've already taken into consideration many of these issues. I don't know if wheelchair accessibility in all our buildings is one of those things we've done. But clearly, we'll be delighted to take that as a challenge and something that we should work on in the state. Once again, I'd like to thank the NTM Foundation and also apologize to you that I can't spend the rest of the day. We will be there oh, yes. for the town hall oh, yes. and really square meeting. And you will tell me when I come to you what you want in the budget, yes. 2012 budget in relation to the budget. Thank you very much.